So we're in the middle of a boreas brittle field here. The way, the way the boreas works is we blow on multiple days. So we, the boreas, it's a big wind machine. It's a huge wind machine that just simulates high gusty winds. And so it comes through here and it breaks corn. And usually by the time a hybrid goes commercial, we'll have, oh boy, I hate to even say, you know, well over 35, 40 data points of just boreas plus natural brittle stock we observe in the field. And that, that can be upwards over 100 data points of that. So we've actually went to using this machine to simulate stock lodging. We're finding out that's about the best, one of the best replicators we can find of late season standability. There's certain GDUs we know where corn is most susceptible to brittle snap, and so we'll target those GDUs. You know, at the end of that five or six years, what's nice is we're able to really understand, okay, what, what's the risk? You know, so we put a brittle score on there, and that's really the overall risk. And we factor in, you know, susceptibility to the early, early snap period, middle snap period, late snap period, the timing of it, and then also the severity of it. It's less than 1% of the material out here is going to see a grower's field. Um, it, it's, it's well less than 1%. So the, the failure rate is extremely high. And the reason the failure rate is extremely high is because the, the success bar is so high. It's, just, it's, it's hard to be good enough to make it through to be in a pioneer bag.